I would like to use this video to talk about one of the most misunderstood commands in Fusion 360 Silhouette Split. It is located on the Modify menu. Now it has three forms. We have Split Shell and Body, Split Faces Only, and Split Solid Body. We will be starting with the Solid Body. Let's talk about the model I'll be using. It is a two-axis single-plane model. As you can see, it changes in its axis, X and Y, but it doesn't change from plane. So the first one we want to look at is silhouette split by a so of a solid body. Now this is basically like splitting the part with a plane going right through the middle of it along the plane widest point. But the advantage of the silhouette split is that you do not have to have a plane. It will find that widest point for you. So first of all, the direction must be, in this case, perpendicular to the cutting plane. So that is the z-axis. Then I pick on the body, and as you can see, it develops a cutting plane for you at the widest point. Say OK, and it will trace out the edge for you. This is now in two bodies. You can actually turn, get rid of one if you'd like. And you, you, you can do anything you want with it. The next silhouette split, this one is a shell body. It's the same model except it's been shelled, as you can see from the analysis. So what we're going to do is basically create that half of the part using the silhouette split. Again, the silhouette split will find the very widest point of this model. Picture it like going through a sheet of paper, and wherever it cuts through, it'll put a cut or a split body. So let's go to silhouette split. Let's change to split shell body, and my plane I want to split on is going to be the same Z and my target body is this. You can see the line developing. You say OK. Now again, there we go. It's two bodies. You can turn off either one you want or you can get rid of it with a remove. Do not delete. You can remove. The third option is split faces only. This one you can make some very interesting models from it. So I go up to Modify, Silhouette Split, I'm going to change to Faces Only. I'm going to pick a direction this way, so my faces will be split along the widest point along this line. So I'm going to pick the Y axis, then pick the model, you see the line automatically develop, and say OK. That line can be used for a variety of purposes. You can project it to a plane to do something like this. Actually. Uh, make a mold. I made that plane from a projected line of that split line and then I made the mold from it. So you can do a variety of things with this particular one. I hope this helps you use the solid body split by silhouette a lot easier.